Ah, greetings. You must be assisting Master Baluk in his investigation. I'm Handan Ghoul. Perhaps you've heard of me? Really? <clears throat> well, then I assure you, on my reputation, I had nothing to do with the killing. I will help you with the case as best I can, though. You see, I was out here running earlier today. Yes, running. I do that a lot. I can't stand speeders, never use them. 
Keeps me in shape, too, you know. Anyway, I was out running on the other side of that bridge there, and all of a sudden I heard a shot coming from over here. I ran over and found this man Calder lying on the ground, dead. And I saw Rickard come skulking out of the shadows of the rocks south of the river, and I knew something was wrong. I hit my emergency button and called the enclave right away. Well, there. That's my story. Now, please hurry this up and arrest Rickard so I can get on with my day. Another Jedi, huh? Helping that Twi'lek investigate, no doubt. He seems stumped. I'm Rickard Lusoff. Maybe you can figure this out and let me get out of here. Well, I was out hunting Eriaz when I spotted one over here by the bridge. I pull out my rifle and aim at it. I couldn't see it that well, mind you, because the damn sun was in my eyes. So I shoot it and it drops. I walk over here and find Handon standing over Calder's body. So why don't you get this whole farce over with and send that whiner Handon to the prison he belongs in? Greetings, Padawan. You must be the one Master Baluk has enlisted to help him with this problem. I am an information retrieval droid. I can assist you by accessing the records of both the Jedi and Clay and the central government facilities here on Dantooine. If you have any need of my services, please do not hesitate to talk to me. I have already retrieved some information from the archives on Cold Anetic, Rickard Lusoff, and Handan Gould. I have also had time to examine the body of Mr. Netic. Is there any information you require? My preliminary analysis of the body indicates that he was killed approximately three hours ago by a single energy blast to the torso. Is there any other information you need? These planes are rife with wild animals, not all of them benign. The Iriars are mostly docile, but can easily be provoked to violence. Calf hounds, on the other hand, are much more deadly. There have been over 35 catalogued attacks on settlers by calf hounds in the last two weeks. A general advisory was given out three days ago to carry a weapon at all times when on the plains. Small farms and holdings dot the plains and can provide safe refuge for those in need. Is there any other information you need? Very well. I will be here to assist you. Uh, Kundi <laughs> Mule <laughs> Kiyenono you malita kuto tun. Chila mula ne nindu bobo. Wonga kumbis chang ba mulera. Ta kumjus tak miki grabul mogo. Kachichu ita bodunga. Tolba bank wale oganda naru chuchut. Mugisha punga bola wana chikye. A mule slimo foda dara nanga kumbis mulera pes. Kachikum ita hodunga.
So, what do you want to know? Yeah, I knew him. Hell, we've known each other for a good long time. Doesn't mean I really have to have liked this slime ball. <sighs> Maybe I shouldn't be so hard on him. Especially now that he's dead. We actually got along pretty well most of the time. We just had our differences. We were actually business partners. We were involved in some orbit-to-ground transport operations for Aerotech. Can I leave now? I should probably be the one to give the news to his wife. So, what do you want to know? I told you already, didn't I? Was hunting some eerie ass. Haven't seen many in the area recently, what with those cat hounds acting up. But they're still around. Was in my blind a little south of here when I spotted one, like I said before. I shot, and pow, went down. But when I come over here, there's Handed standing over the body, and the Eriaz was gone. Now, I don't have nothing to do with this, so can I go now? So, what do you want to know? You Jedi are so predictable, always seeing some greater purpose behind everything, when the simple answer is usually the right one. Can't you see that it must have been Handed? I found him standing over the damned body. I don't know why this is causing you so much trouble. You almost seem as lost as this Baluk guy. So, what do you want to know? Well, I kind of sprained my ankle running through the bush before I found the body, but it's nothing that serious. Right. How can I be of further assistance? I know him a little bit, but I was not any sort of great friend to him or anything. I never really associated with him that much. In truth, I didn't really want to. He had a... reputation. A very inconsiderate of family, I heard. But merely having heard unkind things about someone wouldn't make me want to kill him. How can I be of further assistance? I was taking my daily constitutional. I just happened to be running by when I heard a shot. I ran over and found Calder's body lying there. Yes, quite often. I generally prefer running to anything else. Can't stand speeders. A healthy body will breed a healthy mind, as I always say. <laughs> In injured? No, of course not. Why would I have been? Fit as a bantha. <laughs> That's, I run. I don't know if I mentioned that. How can I be of further assistance? Um, well, you see, Calder was involved in some pretty sordid business from time to time. More often than not, I've heard. Disreputable business practices, even more disreputable clients. I've even heard he had dealings with a hut. A hut here on Dantooine. Now, I bet you're wondering if I had any reasons to kill the man, but I tell you, I hardly knew him. I saw him once or twice, yes, and I've heard some pretty unkind things about him, but certainly nothing that would make me want to kill him. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm getting a bit agitated. Why must we remain here? Can't you see that Rickard must have shot him? Of course, of course. Listen, if you need anything, I shall be glad to assist. Is there any other information you need? The Southwood Speeder Rental Business has records that over the past seven weeks, a speeder had been rented by Mr. Medic and Mr. Gould. Is there any other information you need? According to the municipal authorities near the Garen spaceport, there had been news of violent drunken activity in a cantina attached to the port. Apparently, a Mr. R. Lusoff was making accusations at a Mr. C. Netic about cheating him in a business deal. Jedi Tuka was dispatched to the scene and restored order. Is there any other information you need? Very well. I will be here to assist you. How can I be of further assistance? But I, I realize this must seem like a motive to you, but I assure you it isn't. I dislike Calder, true. I would punch his face in, given the opportunity, but I would not kill him. 
my wife was cheating on me. I slept in my own bed while I was in the next room. But as much as I may hate him for that, I could not kill him. It may have been my own fault for driving my wife away. I must try not to take the law into my own hands. I was just out running, trying to clear my head for the divorce proceedings, not stalking him to kill him. Running is not a crime. Of course, of course. Listen, if you need anything, I shall be glad to assist. So, what do you want to know? Now, I don't love Calder, but we go back a long way. We run a suborbital shipping and transport company out of Garang Spaceport. We've been partners in that business for well over 20 years, and we've been doing just fine the way we are. Right. Uh, ジノモレラケンパイダクスリムポドワマ ゴネコンベスチンパラモレトンキンバムノテトクニンチャトゥコンネモネラベスあ、ここはチェコバジノモレラケンパイダスリムポドワマタコンジュスタクミキグラブモボカチチュウイタボドンガ Tolba Is there any other information you need? We cannot get any more specific analysis from that sample, other than the fact he did not belong to Kolder. Is there any other information you need? Very well. I will be here to assist you. So, what do you want to know? That blaster? Never seen it before. Calder himself had a preference for Ichani weaponry. He had this one really nice light blaster rifle that he always used. Always wished I could get myself a rifle like the one you had. Ichanis make delicate weapons with too little firepower. Lightweight stuff, if you ask me. That blaster ain't it, though. Calder only had the one rifle, too. So he either must have borrowed that, or it's someone else's. Right. How can I be of further assistance? That blaster was stolen from my house last week. I never knew what happened to it. I hardly have enough money to afford a single blaster, let alone another. I can't tell you how important it is to have a weapon on hand with all these ravenous calf hounds around. Even an Eries can take a man down if it gets in the mood. Every settler has a weapon. It's our most prized possession. I would most appreciate it if I could have that back after you determine that Rickard is the killer. How can I be of further assistance? Of course, of course. Listen, if you need anything, I shall be glad to assist. Is there any other information you need? I am sorry, but I seem to be failing you. I have searched and searched, but I cannot seem to come up with anything at all. I thought to find the record of the missing weapon report Mr. Gould filed with the authorities, but there does not seem to be one. Is there any other information you need? Very well. I will be here to assist you. How can I be of further assistance? I can block off, maybe, sure, but not kill him. 
Oh my. I hope you don't find that incriminating. You know, normally I'm not prone to outbursts like that, but Calder, Mr. Medic, he was not a very nice person. Not a very nice person to me or my family. I had had my suspicions for several weeks, but had no proof until two days ago. It seems Calder was seeing my wife. Right under my nose, no less. Well, if you can't keep her, it's your own fault. But, as much as I may hate him for that, I could not kill him. It may have been my own fault for driving my wife away. I must try not to take the law into my own hands. I was just out running, trying to clear my head for the divorce proceedings, not stalking him to kill him. Running is not a crime. Of course, of course. Listen, if you need anything, I shall be glad to assist. ちんばらもれ、とんきんばのだ。とんきんちゃとこんで、ぬれらべす。かちこんいだほどんが。いきんこのばもれらちこん。せもぽどなるでおどんがこうんかべ。もちゃしゃっぱかった。きげのの生パ
Mule Slimo, Huda da la Nanga, Kumbis, Mule Rabes, Kachi Kun Ida Haldonga, Ikin Kuno Pa Mule Rachi Kun, Slimo Podona, Rundi Hodunga Kun Hunkabe, Rundi Di Hodunga Kun Hunkabe, Wana Kundes Ching Pala Mule, Tunking Ba Nunotek, Tukning Chatu Kunne, Mule Rabes. Tong hai tuam jiji jum lumpa, nita poe tikitu, dolfa da bongwaleo gandona chuchut, kachi chu ita dundonga, yumalita kuto tun, chila mulane ni dubobo, wonga kumbis chang ba mulera. Damn you, damn both of you. Ta kumjis tachniki grabul mogo, kachi chu ita bondunga. Tolba bank, wale o ganda naru chuchut. Bole shia punga, bola wana chikne. Na mule slimo, hoda dala nanga kumbis, mule rabes. Ka chikun ida hao donga, ikin kuno pa mule ra chikun. Slimo podo na, nande ho donga ku hunka be. Tong hai tuam jiji jung lupa, nita poe tikitu. Dolpa da bongwaleo gandona chuchut. Kachi chu ita dundonga. Yumalita kuto tun. Chila mulane ni dubobo. Ponga kumbis chang ba mulera. Well done. I'm impressed. Not sure I could have done as well. Achuta. Ponga kumbis dolpi kikumiana. Don patugas vaktilea. Thank <laughs> you.